Finally, we have some amazing good news for Carnival Cruise fans as the Carnival Mardi Gras is handed over in a virtual ceremony by Shipyard Meyer Tuku in Finland. And why was it handed over in a virtual ceremony? Well, because it's 2020, of course. But even though this cruise ship has been delayed a couple of times, it is finally here and we are set for 2021 when the Mardi Gras is due to be sailing in April 2021 from Port Canaveral. Now in this video, I am going to be sharing with you some photos and videos of the seven things that we really love about the Carnival Mardi Gras. Now before I get started, I wanted to mention that my name is Ilana from the website lifewallcruise.com and if you do enjoy this video, please do give it a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it and of course, please consider subscribing to the channel where we share videos like this of tours of cruise ships, but we also share cruise news and cruise tips as well. So let's take a look at the Carnival Mardi Gras. So the first thing that we love about the Carnival Mardi Gras is how new and groundbreaking this cruise ship is. And of course, because it finally gives us some good news for cruising in 2021, which we definitely need. The original Mardi Gras was the first cruise ship for the Carnival Cruise Lines to sail. And that ship sailed between 1972 and 1973. Now all the photos that you'll be looking at today and the videos are courtesy of the Meyer Turku shipyard in Finland and Carnival Cruise Lines and thank you for that. It really gives us a good idea of how absolutely gorgeous and amazing this cruise ship is. Now the Carnival Mardi Gras is 180,000 tons. That is definitely the absolute largest cruise ship built for the Carnival brand and the seventh largest cruise ship built in the world. The only other one for Carnival that will be the same size is the Celebration, which is due to come out its sister ship in 2022. In a first for Carnival and for the cruise industry, the Mardi Gras boasts the very first roller coaster at sea. Yes, it's the Bolt, the sea coaster that actually required an investment of millions of dollars and is an engineering marvel. Now you can take a look at who the first passenger was at the shipyard. Now we also love how absolutely gorgeous the interior of this cruise ship is. You can take a look and see how stunning the grand atrium is. And this ship is actually divided up into several neighborhoods or zones. So you can have six different areas of the ship that all have a very different feel. Now, do you love cruise food as much as I do? If you do, then you will absolutely love some of the restaurant choices on the Mardi Gras. And this includes some restaurants that just haven't been seen on other Carnival cruise ships. So definitely first for the cruise industry. So we have Emerald's Bistro, definitely one of the most highly anticipated restaurants. Now that is a specialty restaurant, so there is an extra charge. There are quite a few others that are also really going to be fabulous, but we also have the included restaurant called Big Chicken, which is one of Shaq's restaurant. It serves uh, fried chicken. Now Shaq O'Neill is actually the chief fun officer for Carnival. So this is definitely going to be a fun venue to eat at. And just take a look at all of those gorgeous venues that we can eat at on this carnival ship. I'm excited for it. And we also have some bars because let's face it, drinking on a cruise ship is also fun. And those include the Red Frog, Fortune Teller, Brass Magnolia, and of course, Alchemy. Now, I think this is pretty game changing for the cruise industry. And this is the fact that the Mardi Gras runs on an LNG propulsion system. And this is liquefied natural gas. And this is just basically a more environmentally friendly way to run the cruise ship. And it means that the Mardi Gras will be one of the most environmentally friendly cruise ships at sea. Now, what would a carnival ship be like without its water slides? And this aqua park on the Mardi Gras is definitely another first. It is amazing. It boasts the largest carnival aqua park at sea. The water park includes several water slides, including the Twister, the Blue Lightning, the Orange Thunder with a 229 foot drop slide and the Splash Park. It really is the largest and most elaborate carnival water park and it will surely be enjoyed by kids of all ages. So I hope you enjoyed seeing some of those pictures and videos of the carnival Mardi Gras and if you are sailing on this ship that it helped to get you a little bit excited about what is to come. If you are planning to sail on the Mardi Gras or if you were booked to sail on it and if that was cancelled and you're still looking ahead please let me know 
in the comments below. And if you did enjoy this video, please do give it a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. And of course, please consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't done so already. Thanks so much for watching and happy cruising.